hello guys welcome back to my channel so for today's video i created this beautiful look using one palette and i show you guys step by step how i created this look also i show you guys my foundation routine or how i do my foundation concealer and everything uh, so i show you guys how i created this lip combo so if you want to see how i created this look then please keep on watching thank you okay so for today's video i'm gonna be using this palette from morphe is the 3503 friends by nature and this is how it looks and i created this look it kind of is giving me like watermelon vibes nice like i was saying it's giving me like watermelon vibes it's like uh neon green hot pink black and that's it so let me show you guys how i made this look real quick um i actually wanted to tell you guys i got these um se llama? cleansers and detox vitamina son unas gummies and it's a really cute package i don't know if you have guys have tried this before but if you had let me know how it worked for y'all i'm trying to show you guys but it's not fucking seen i got it from walgreens and it's my first time uh trying them i got them today after work and i'm not going to be opening them because i don't i know vinegar is like really strong so yeah i don't know how to how can i open this this is how it opened but i guess uh, i think i didn't open it right or i don't know if it's just like this no yeah i think it's like this these are really cute packaging packaging and so here's this you know like something inside like let me see if you can see like yeah see that yeah i don't know what is that but yeah okay so huelen un poquito raro it's really good they are vegan free, gluten free. Oh, vegan friendly and gluten free. So I might be taking them from starting today. Okay, so. Okay, so first. I'm going to be using this wet and wild brush and I'm gonna be going in with this neon green like a lime green green oh make sure you have um, concealer or eye primer and then I'm going to be packing the shade all over all over the lid first And then with this thing, I'm going to be cleaning my brush. And then I'm going to start blending the shadow. And then if you need more, you just pack the shade and blend, blend, blend. Okay. So now I, I want to just to do like that simple look and then... Um, put eyelashes and like just you know do my face or whatever but then i was like no i'm just gonna be adding something else whatever but i feel like i see and then some lashes i want to blend this a little bit more i 
I don't know if there's a difference, but I'm going to be cutting my crease. I'm going to be using my e.l.f. concealer. It's on the shade Fair Warm. Yes, I'm going to be cutting my crease with this one. It's easier, faster. And then the flat brush, I'm just going to use it like to blend the concealer, basically. Okay, so I'm grabbing a little bit of the concealer. And then I'm going to be cutting my crease. I already cut my crease this is how it looks and then with the same palette I'm gonna be grabbing this shimmery uh, hot pink and I'm gonna apply that with this flat brush and I'm just gonna be packing that shade on top of the concealer Okay, I'm going to be um, adding some black shadow in the outer corner. I'm going to be using this one right here. And this palette no trae nombre, so I'm going to be using this smaller brush to be a packing the, funda the foundation, to be packing the black shadow and to be blending the shadow. And then I'm going to be cleaning the brush. Make sure to clean the brush before blending any black shadow. Blending the shadow. And every time I'm applying some shadow, I'm cleaning my brush before blending the shadow. <music> So now that looks like that, I'm gonna go back with this bigger brush. It's the Morphe G17, and I'm gonna blend the black and the green shadow together. Okay, so I'm gonna be making a line. This eyeliner is from Wet n Wild, it's um, like a pen eyeliner. And then for the neon um, liner, I'm gonna be using this one from from NYX. Is this one? And I'm just gonna be following the crease donde corte con el um, con el concealer. That's what I'm gonna be following basically. gonna let it dry a little bit i think i went a little bit too far <laughs> but it's okay i'm gonna let it dry and then i'm gonna go back and add a little bit more okay for my lashes i'm gonna be using this one from the dollar tree they're the ionic lashes they're on the sh style a very good cake a very good cake um, I have never used them. It's my first time that I'm gonna be using them. They're really cute. Let me uh, show you guys como se miran más cerquitas. I need to cut them for sure because I'm pretty sure they're not gonna fit my eye. They're not too dramatic. Okay, so this is how the eyelashes look. They're not too dramatic. They look. I think they look perfect with this look. No les quita mucho al look. Okay, so 
to prime my face i'm gonna be using this primer from beauty creations it's a setting powder powder a setting um spray yeah and then i'm gonna be using my infernable foundation this is on the shade golden beige 104 And to be blending my foundation, I'm going to be using this uh, brush from Bibela Cosmetics. Okay, so I already blend out my foundation and then I'm going to be using my uh, Frankie Rose concealer. To contour my face, I'm going to be using this contour stick from the Dollar Tree. It's on the shade medium. contour my face and my nose i'm going to be using this palette from beauty creations <music> Okay, so I already set my face. I'm letting this for a little bit longer. Let me do my undershadow. I'm gonna be doing my undershadow. I'm gonna be using the same palette. I look, I look kind of funny, but I haven't decided what shade I wanna put under my eyes. So, uh, so I'm gonna be using my Morphe E17, which is the, this one is one of my favorites blending brush to use i'm gonna be adding this brown shade and then this black shade on top of the brown so first i'm gonna be putting some powder under my eyes for any fallout para que quede en el powder y luego nada más a wipe it wipe it out and my foundation no se va a manchar Does it look cute or not? I hope it does. I'm gonna be adding some highlight. I'm gonna be using this Sephora brush. It's a fan brush. And then with my Morphe Y22, I'm gonna be adding some highlight to my inner corner. Oh, 
Okay, so I guess this is the final look. Oh no, no, okay, final look. My lipstick. Okay, so for my lip combo, I'm gonna be using this lippy from Light Glam. The name is So Fly, and then I'm gonna be using this uh, lip line liner from Light Glam also. The name is Pick and Pie. I'm gonna be adding some lip gloss on top of this uh, lip combo. Okay, so I don't know how to feel about this look with this lipstick. I don't feel like it goes with with the with the look. I feel like I look at the mirror and I like how I look. Maybe with another shirt. But when I look at the camera, I don't like it. But I don't want to take it off because I'm going to mess up my foundation. So I'm just going to leave it. But yes, guys, I guess this is the final look. Do I look like a raccoon or do I look cute or I don't know like I don't know how to feel it's because I don't be trying out like new first I start trying out like eyeshadows and then whenever like I would do like a crazy eyeshadow then I will be like no I don't like it but then I got used to it now that I'm trying lip different lip glosses lip combos it's like I don't like it but I know they're cute but I don't know let me know if you guys like this combo and if you did please don't forget to give me a thumbs up please don't forget to like comment and subscribe to my channel everything that i use is going to be linked down below uh all my social medias are going to be linked down below also if you want to follow me let me know and i will follow you back let me know that you're coming from my youtube channel and i will follow you back so yes guys thank you so much for watching and i see you guys in my next video bye